Hello. In this demo, we are going to see how to migrate container images from AWS ECR to Microsoft ECR using Rackware Swift. So let's begin with our demo. Firstly, go to Swift dashboard and log in using the set credentials. If you need more information about setting password or creating a user, download the operations guide and follow the mentioned steps. After logging into the Swift dashboard, you can see that there is an image registry section. All the discovered registries must be present here. Before going ahead with the process, let's have a look at our source and destination registries. For this particular demo, we have chosen ECR as the source side, but you can choose Oracle OCR, Google GCR, Docker Hub, or even do intra registry syncs by selecting ACR. Here we can see that there are various repositories. We are going to sync some of these repositories to our target side, which is Azure Container Registry. Now let's look at let's have a look at our target registry. So this is our target registry. Let's see some of the repositories that are already present here. All right. Now let's go back to Swift and begin our sync process. Before the sync would proceed, we first need to discover the registries on Swift. So let's do that first. For doing that, click on add. Give a relevant name to your source side registry. Uh, if you don't give one, Swift will generate one for you. Now our source registry has been discovered. Let's go ahead and discover our destination site registry. Our target site registry has also been discovered. Now let's see what's inside these registries. Here you can see a short summary of the registry. Uh, most of it um, are the cloud details. And you can also see the state in which the registry is right now. So it is in the discovered state. Last errors if there are any. And also image repositories that we just saw. So the data about these repositories and tags have been downloaded on the Swift. All right, similarly, we can see the source side as well. So the summary of the registry, last errors and image repositories. All right, now let's migrate the container images. For doing that, click on sync administration all replications click on new then registry replication now filling the source and the target site details the source type would be amazon aws the friendly name should be the one that we have discovered recently click the one you want source is here so next we have to provide all repositories or selective repositories so for this demo we are going to go ahead with selective repositories Go on, click, go on and click selective. So now we have to select any particular repositories we wish to migrate to the target side. So for this demo, we are going to go ahead with ECR demo, WordPress and WordPress MariaDB. Click the plus icon. So these repositories have been added now. Now let's fill in the target set details. The target type would be Microsoft Azure. Friendly name would be Destination Azure that we just recently discovered. Now then, now let's have a look at our next options. So verbose sync by clicking this option, 
you will get detailed information about the sync via via the log files so i'm going to go ahead with this option job name give a relevant job name i'm going to give it if you don't give one swift will generate one for you the next option is dry run so dry run is uh, is an option which is provided to ensure that the sync will work, work perfectly but it wouldn't migrate any images from source to the target side but we do want the images to be migrated so i'm not going to select this option so let's go ahead and click add now the sync is running you can get uh, to know the get to know about the status of the sync by looking at the status column here you can see various checkpoints that uh, that are sent by swift if you want more information click on this job you can see some object sync statistics so as 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 of now we don't have any object sync statistics so let's go and check out sync progress so in sync progress you will get to see the checkpoints that are sent by swift and you will come to know about how how far has the sync gone all right now let's wait for this sync to be completed the checkpoints are updated every 15 seconds you can change that by going over here now our sync is complete let's uh, see what are the statistics so five tags were synced two repositories were synced and two were created and four were created uh, so you might remember that we had three repositories selected but only two were synced that was because we already had one one that is wordpress present here so it wasn't created and even the tag inside this repository was same now let's refresh and see if the two other repositories um, have been created here so yes you can see ecl demo and wordpress mariadb has have been created here so we'll go inside wordpress mariadb and look at this one image that we have over here to verify if this is the same image that we ha have on the source side let's look at the digest over here so it begins with d573e so let's go to our source side registry and check if this image is correct or not so here you can see wordpress mariadb there is one image inside it and you can see that the digest is d573eb which matches with our destination site registry okay so that's what we wanted to show in this demo we migrated some repositories from aws ecr to azure acr if you have any further questions please reach out to us at support@retrackerinc.com thank you